What's up everyone, it's your favorite Rude Boy here and I'm at Iron Heart Evolution and I got something I'm really excited to show you guys. Uh, so, about two years ago I started this massive thing and uh, I don't have a time lapse for it because it was long before uh, I had this channel or even did time lapse videos. But yeah, I started this massive painting and a few weeks ago I finally got to finish it so I want to show it to y'all. And uh, I'm super excited because this is some of my original characters. It kind of tells a story, but uh, I'm gonna get the camera all set up and then I'll show it to y'all. So here it is behind me. It's three feet tall by 20 feet wide. And this painting took me about two years to do um, off and on, you know, it wasn't a solid two years. But uh, yeah, like I was saying, it's a bunch of my original characters. They all have a storyline hang out with me a lot you already know what their story is um maybe i'll make another video where i kind of get into that a little more but uh yeah let's go in for a close-up you know kind of see what's going on all right so this first character right here is dr kevorkian and he's kind of the uh antagonist of the story over his shoulder right there is salvador and salvador is the uh childlike imagination of uh, Hector here and he actually like crawls out of his head and causes mischief. These little sperm looking things are uh, Hector's other voices because Hector's schizophrenic. And then you have Eli, he's an elephant and he belongs to Hector, um, he's kind of a slave, It's a little fucked up. Over here you have Nigel. Nigel is an explorer until his family was killed and uh, he ended up eating some bark or smoking some bark off this tree and uh, it kind of chirped him out and now he looks like that. And then we have Ralph. Ralph is the gatekeeper of where all these characters live and then those are two seed gods. They're kind of like watchers and uh, just kind of watch what's going on. But yeah. Um, it's kind of crazy how much that my style has changed within those two years. Because there's this, and then you got one of my more recent paintings like Medusa right here. So my style's changed quite a bit, I've gotten a lot better with blending my uh, colors and tones, getting them a little smoother. But yeah, I put a lot of work into this painting. It's a little crazy. You can stare at it forever and keep just seeing new things. But yeah, I hope y'all really enjoy this. If you want to see it uh, in person, come down to Ironheart Evolution. Say hello, maybe get a tattoo, or just check out the artwork. So there you have it. Dream State Mega Painting. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this real short video. I hope you enjoyed this painting. I put a lot of time into it. Uh, there's a lot of sentimental value to these characters. Um, but yeah, if you enjoyed it, crush that thumbs up. Uh, if you want to see more of my videos, subscribe and hit that notification so you know when new videos drop. Um, if you have any comments or questions, go ahead and drop them down below. Until next time, root boy out.